What's up guys, my name is Game Imposter and welcome back to Prince of Persia the Two you Thrones. Know oh. that it was not love that drove him, but duty. I was his responsibility. He had made a promise, a promise that was now broken and undone. As with all mistakes he had made, the prince meant to fix this. A noble goal to be certain, but a selfish one as well. For he was motivated to ease his own pain. Yeah, I uh, kind I do remember uh, some parts where the dialogue begins. Yeah, but not all of them. I know these streets. I must keep pace with Kylina if I'm to find the one responsible for this. If I remember, yeah, there are like two guys here. I don't remember ever succeeding in killing these guys. Only because, like, you see the archer there? I don't remember, does he ever turn his back? Okay, this looks like the first time to strike. Okay, I yeah, know it wasn't. Oh, wow! Come here, come here. Vince stab. Yeah, I don't remember ever doing this selfly. The way you gotta do it is not just climb up the wall, you just gotta jump there. Yeah. Okay, okay, we're close. We're getting close. Oh yeah, this is gonna be. Oh yeah, this is the part where the two guys attack me. Yeah, now I remember. Epa, epkaye. I don't want to drop down, cause you see, like, oh wait, I gotta turn around. You see that that those doors that that uh, open gate. At least I think that's the gate. Yeah, from that place, there's gonna be like two guys coming in. Or from the side, I don't remember where, but... Oh, yep. Look, they spawn there. Come here. Come here. It's much more fun when you jump around on them. Oh, I barely even used my secondary. Nice. Okay, up. Keeping up my balance, and we gotta jump here. Whew. Yeah, move up. Funny enough, now when I think about Prince Persia, I think it did borrow a couple of assets from uh, Splinter Cell, at, le at least uh, the two thrones do. Because, like, look, I remember Sam Fisher. Does that split jump thing also? Okay, nobody else around me. So sweet. Huh. Okay, that may seem safe, but it's really death down there. There's, there's nothing worthy of interest. Any weapons here? Nope, no new weapons. Oh, these guys. Yeah, I remember this. This is gonna be. Tricky. It's like for the first part of the game. Wait. They even. <laughs> then I got a. One. Two. And nobody else comes in. Nobody knows. Who cares? <laughs> okay. So, no, not up here. Not up here. I gotta... Oh yeah, that that's where I gotta go. The camera showed me it. Turn around. I just have the biggest smile right now. Oh! 
so weak. Okay, that was close. Too close, in fact. Are you gonna turn around? Are you gonna run? Is there anyone else around here? There doesn't seem to be any way I could climb anything. So I'm guessing no, there's nobody else around here. Okay, he's gonna start talking right now. No? Why do I remember him talking somewhere around here? Huh. Oh crud! I pressed the wrong button. Okay, I was blocking, I was spamming the block button. God damn it. I gotta... I gotta... One second pause. Sorry, I had to go somewhere. My... My little brother had wanted some... Tea, so I had to make him some tea. He's sick, I can't say no to that kind of stuff, so, yeah. Okay, let's retry this. I gotta run along the wall, jump. And not press the jump button to kill him. Keep it steady, keep it. Here we go. And they're dead. Now was it that hard? No, it wasn't. Oof. Combat gets a little bit easier once you get the relic. Let's just put it away like that. <laughs> oh, I remember this one. It's gonna be... Eh... No, no. Yeah. Yeah, this, this the wall jump thing. <laughs> I think I was saying something about Splinter Cell and uh, Prince Persia. Yeah, like, I noticed that uh, some of the movements in the two thrones really remind me of the way Sam sh kind Asha, who would stand before her stall selling fruits and flowers. Or the errant children, making trouble as all young ones do. Gone. All gone. Yeah, because of most of his movements do remind me of Sam Fisher and the way he would do things. Turn around. Try you don't have to do this stealthily, as I said, but uh, but I'm telling you, it's the optimal way of doing things. If you don't do it stealthily, you're gonna get screwed over, like I have. I believe that's a perfect example of not doing anything stealthily in this game. Yeah, actually, even the stealth edition kind of reminds me of S Sam Fisher. <laughs> huh. The first Splinter Cell game ca game came out in 2003, and uh, Warrior with Within came out ar around the same time, also. Huh. Now, if I remember this one, is it the annoying one? Yeah, it's this, the one that I have had trouble figuring out. Okay, so yeah, basically, I the last time I played this game. Um, oh, wall jump. Do you want me to do me? Yeah. Last time I played this game, I couldn't see the boards because they were paper thin from my perspective. Well, at least... I don't know, maybe I just was I stupid and I didn't just notice them the last time. time. Home. And yet nothing is as I remember. Objects once familiar and comforting now fill me with uncertainty and dread. 
Oh god damn it! It seems like I was go about to make it. Shit. Yeah, the perspective is sometimes a little off. Home. And yet nothing is as I remember. Objects once familiar and comforting now fill me with uncertainty and dread. What has happened here? Oh god fucking damn it. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to climb up. And this is the part where they get annoying. And you can't dodge those things. Yeah, you want to take out the arrow guys first. God damn it, there's... Yeah, this is why I recommend stealth. Because it's... Those guys are super annoying. You cannot believe how much. Okay. That's, that's not really gonna help me in a situation like this. Roll, roll. Oh god damn it. Look at you, Mr. Fancy. Oh man. Die already. I swear, sometimes it seems like they take they take they take nine or ten hits to kill. Sometimes they just like being dicks. Yeah, if I would have done this the stealthy way, I would have been able to go up there, there. But for some reason The Prince didn't want to go straight up. Now he does want to go straight up. Why? Because the prince likes to play around with me. Eh, guess I can't really stay mad at an old friend like him. Oop. The perspective sometimes helps and sometimes it doesn't. It's really just depends on where are you at that particular time. Yeah, I'm not supposed to go here. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so I think I was supposed to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to. I had to do this the stealthy way again. I gotta climb up there. I think the only way I can do that is from where I saw. Yep. Nope. Maybe. Let Let's just figure it out first. Damn! All those dead soldiers of mine. I can't really blame them. They have these guys have cheaty snipers. I don't can't climb up that. I can't climb up that. Maybe I was going the right way, except I missed something. I tend to forget the platforming bits, even though it's the majority of the game. Trust me, it sounds it sounds stupid, but that's how it is right now. Okay. All right. So, while hanging from here, I should be able to do nothing. Oh yeah, now I see it. Yep, that's just a stealthy bit. This is what I gotta do. I gotta stab these little holes and then... And I gotta... Nope. Wrong button. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I tend to forget the platforming bits because I didn't really care much for them until it got super interesting. Jump. Oh, and I also remember... Okay, where's the switch? I remember this one part of the game where uh, I actually get launched from one of those little pads over there. Like th these things, and I actually get to kill an archer, which was the most satisfying stealth kill I've ever seen. Is this the part? No. Okay, I gotta run, run, run. Stab, then drop, then I gotta jump there. Whoop! Sucks to be you. Anyone else? Anyone else? No, just a lot of pots. Just a lot of pots. Okay. Yeah, I gotta climb up here. No. If I okay, if I have to jump there, then that means I gotta walk all the way around here, and then I gotta smash those pots. 
sm smashed vase. Just walk on it. Can I jump on it? Nope, I can Mario stomp it. Oh no, I, I think I can jump it. Nope, I can't jump it. God damn it. Okay, let me figure that out. Oh, wait, the columns? Yeah, here we go, the columns. Why do I remember this not helping me in la the last time I did? Oh, okay, now I remember. At least I think I remember. Yep, here we go. Sometimes the platforming can be a little bit obscure. I can make... Can I make that jump? There's that little climby thing. Do I... Oh no, that's uh, probably where I came from, yeah. And this is where the platforming it really comes in handy. Okay. Then we gotta... Carefully... Carefully... Jump! And we're gonna fry this little birdie. Chicken soup, anyone? Yeah. Oh, wait. I remember this one. Yeah. Come here. Remember the key? Wait, there's, there should be another... Isn't this... Yeah. Oh, fuck me. I remember this one. It's like way over there. Wait. Okay. Self mode off. He does that automatically if anybody's wondering. Okay, from there to there. Oh, that's where it came from. Remember that. Oh, son of a bitch! The hog guy saw me. Did he? Oh, wait, is this. Yeah! <laughs> this is the part where I get launched and I stab him. Come on, come on! Hurry up, hurry up. God, yes! <laughs> And start the speed kill. No oh, pole! <laughs> There's just something so satisfying of getting launched into a guy and just stabbing him instantly. Oh god, that feels so good. I should be resting now, recovering from my time away, or sitting with father. Instead, I'm forced to run and hide, sneaking about like a common thief, hunted in my own city. Okay. Son of a bitch, did they hear that? Nope. They're death. Can use that to my advantage. Okay. Nope. Wrong side. Son of a bitch! That doesn't even matter anymore. Block it! No fuck this guy. Fuck you! Damn it! I forget that this guy does combo strikes, not single strikes. You will be seeing that death screen over and over only in the first bits. Don't worry, I don't it's not gonna happen in the later bits. Oh god damn it. Well, on the plus side, we're gonna get launched again. The most satisfying kill in the game. Okay, well there's way more satisfying kills than this, but Covering from my time away. It, this is just one of those things that gets that Instead gets stuck I'm in your head and you and hide, 
sneaking about like a common thief, hunted in my own okay. city. This time, let's try killing them without alerting them. Like that. Okay, yeah, I forgot their death. God damn it. Okay. Carefully. Hold. 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 It's really awkward to turn while holding balance. You, you tend to lose a little bit of it. There we go. Thrill of the kill. Okay. If I jump there, I will fall. I remember that part. Yeah, you gotta put so much effort to kill one guy. Stealthily. Thank God that I was out of his range before I lost balance. How does he not see me? I have no idea. Like an assassin, like an assassin's creed. These guys are stupid. And stabbed. Okay, let's continue on to the next section, shall we? Okay, and more platform. Good. side and they're gonna drag her along here right yep she gets dragged along hi there sweetheart I can make it I can make it I can make it I can make it I can make I wish there was a shout button because I remember myself one time being really close towards saving her and I just got really enraged because um, the prince couldn't make it it was like this close towards stabbing those guys I know you can't stab them but I was a this kid, I was like, <laughs> I was like seven years old back then, or something like that. Wait a second, eight minutes. Oh my, the spiky bits, yeah. Oh wait, now I remember, you just gotta run like hell, and then roll. I don't know why do I do that, but I like to roll. This is the one thing I never understood in the principle in this game. Or, or any Prince of Persia game for that matter. Where the fuck did all these traps come from? And why would you need it in this kind of palace? Also, there's a lot of... Weird... Structures in general in this castle. Not every man can wall jump. That's the one thing I never understood. In a Prince of Persia game. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh my, this is so tricky. Not really, just gotta... Oh, oh, that's how we're gonna play this. Okay. Weapon. And okay, my one's a little dented, so I'll just throw it there and I'll pick this one up. One, two. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, so that's the move that I did earlier. Okay. Here we go, and I remember I gotta do this timed, yeah, well not timed exactly, it's just gotta stab it in here and then I gotta jump across, and that thing is slowly, wait a sec, look down, yeah it's like uh, merges back with the wall. Oh man, Pay this attention one- attention to what the prince overheard as he drew close to where I was being kept. Thank you. <laughs> she, I like how she's just like, look, look, listen to this shit. All right. My story. I will continue my story from here next time. Yeah, that that was a little bit random from her side, just like breaking the fourth wall a little bit. I don't even know who she's 
who, who is she talking to? I mean, like, maybe me as the player, if, if that's... Many years ago, I journeyed with the Maharaja of India to the island of time, intending to claim its secrets. What we discovered was a barren, ruined place. Its halls deserted, and its guardians went to sand. Strange... <laughs> Hourglass covered in jewels and books. Such secrets they contain. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I have a tendency of tripping over stuff. No pun intended. No Many drug, years ago, drug I journeyed joke intended. with the Maharaja of India to the island of time, intending to claim its secrets. <laughs> what we discovered was a barren, ruined place. Its halls deserted, and its gardens gone to sand. Strange things on its walls were spoken. We returned to India. <laughs> Wait, okay, that does not count as a fucking fail. He just glitched through the fucking... You gotta be kidding me. Really? So, let me get this straight. A saw does not kill the Many prince, but ago, apparently jumping from this height will kill him. To Note to self, what prince has l the legs of a... Uh, I don't know, some kind of really thin, helpless animal. Seriously, how can he survive a saw but not a... But you were gone. They were gone. Or so I think. I turned my attention toward the others. Four weeks ago, the dagger stirred. She whispered to me in my sleep. It drew me here towards Babylon. Alas, the Maharaja did not share my view. Would not grant me leave. So I slew him and claimed his kingdom, his army for my own. Nothing would stand between me and my desire. Carefully. Oh, do I? I can't. I can't go any further. Apparently, that little thing is blocking the way. Okay. Just shimmy along this side. Another guard down there. Nope, nothing there. I'm not even sure where did I hear that voice from, but uh, certainly wasn't from this pillow or plate or throne. This is some big ass throne. <laughs> oh my god! It yeah, I remember. I remember myself. Seeing this throne for the very first time, and I thought to myself, "Wow, that that must be really <laughs> that must be a really fat king there." The prince's father must have been a fan of Burger King or something. I don't know. I'm pretty sure the thrones in Persia aren't. <gasps> Holy crap! You are a pussy. You literally can. Oh my fucking god, I'm gonna stab this guy. I'm gonna stab the prince. You know what, guys? I'm gonna press pause here and I'm gonna continue where I died. Because of fucking hell. I remember why I hated parts of this game. Ugh. What 
the fuck is happening? <laughs> I alarmed this guy and he's flipping the hell out. <laughs> what the? <laughs> I just wanted to. Oh, I didn't want. I'm gonna continue my video from this point. Hi, sorry. Yeah, you're gonna die. Stop stabbing me. Wow, we flipped at the same time. Well, bye bye, flippy buddy. <laughs> Holy shit. Well. Yeah, now. Okay. Remember what they said that I remember that they were guys back here? Apparently, I was right. And apparently, I can make that jump. Okay. <laughs> Double kill. Well, I guess it does make sense that I have to stab these guys two times. After all, this. the prince drew his weapon and charged forward, intending to rescue me. It was as if he had learned nothing from his past adventures. Or perhaps he'd simply forgotten, made blind and deaf by fear and rage. This is how it happened. This is how I died. No! What have we here? The vizier! Ah, you must be the prince of Persia. Come home at last. Too late, I'm afraid. I believe I have something of yours. Oh, no! The dagger of time. Mm. Yeah, that's the relic that I've been talking about. <laughs> That's gotta hurt. Oh, by the way, I keep that chain in my arm throughout the whole entire game. Okay, I'm gonna end this video once I reach the safe spot because I don't remember where the safe spot is. Yeah, the dagger. I fucking love it. And that's the most unluckiest. That's unluck the most unluckiest person in this whole entire palace, castle, whatever they call it in Persia. <laughs> oh crud, oh crud, okay, oh, whoops. Yeah. Okay, wait. Oh, yeah, now I remember the button was behind me. Jump. And roll. And then jump again. Oh, sweet. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> Finally. I love the dagger. You, don't, you cannot believe how epic does this weapon get later on in the game <laughs> hmm okay well 
Looks like we're not gonna come back here anytime soon. A prince without a palace. Should I continue from here? Yes, you can. This is a fine place to start the tale next time. Alright guys, I'll continue my adventure next time on Prince of Persia the Two Thrones. God I fucking love this game. Even though I tend to die a lot in it, I still love it. Usually the games that I like the most kill me a lot, so yeah, don't be surprised if every game that I say is awesome is really gonna kill me over and over and over again. Till next time. I fucking love this dagger!